Wow, this is hot. It was so hot over there that I almost fainted. I started seeing black. Be careful on this part. This is scary. This is the closest I've ever been to fainting. Oh my God. This is not safe. I kid you not, this is degree burn. This country has a river so hot, it can kill you. Electricity made from poop and people that speak with fruits. Bye -bye. You will never guess what the country is because I'm about to take you to the most interesting country in Latin America. Welcome to... When I landed in Peru, I heard a lot about Machu Picchu and the Rainbow Mountains. I don't want to show you this stuff today. Today, I want to show you the people. Yeah! The people shocked me because everyone here spoke with fruits. Pineapple. Sweet potato. Avocado. Papaya! Yes, in Peru, they use fruits and veggies as slang words. Apurate, no seas lenteja! So papaya means easy! Avocado means embarrassing! And pineapple means Amani! Food as a language. Interesting. Yeah! And turns out the most popular food in the world comes from Peru, a vegetable that billions of people eat all around the world, potato! the potato. Yes, the potato that you and I eat came from Peru thousands of years ago. And today, they have nearly 4,000 types of potatoes. The home of potatoes. Interesting. But perhaps the most interesting thing about Peru was this river. A river that is so hot, it's boiling, it can kill you. So my friends and I had to see it. Cut the video. I have something important to say. Instead of just making videos about the world, now I want to show you the world with your own eyes. We're launching a new thing called NAS Travels. And yeah, it's going to be sick. Seven day trips to countries around the world. Malta, Egypt, India, Ethiopia, Taiwan, Easter Island, wherever. If you're interested in this, let us know. And you'll be the first to know when this launches. Go to nas.io slash travel nas.io slash travel and uh, we'll let you know when we launch. This is very exciting. See the world the Nas daily way. Anyway, I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. We went to the world's biggest rainforest, the Amazon. We took many buses and taxis until we got there. We hiked for five hours through ancient trees, colorful birds, and piranhas. I feel like I was saying this, but this is the closest I've ever been to fainting. It's really, really hot, really, really high, and really, really hot again. And the smoke, the smoke makes you faint. The steam, the steam. The it's steam. It's like a giant outdoor sauna, but there's no escape. Yeah, <laughs> exactly what she said. <laughs> As we continued, the water started to get hot. Very hot. Wow, it's getting hotter. Dude, you should have seen it. It was really cold outside. Really cold. And within a split second, it became super hot. If we fall in this water, we're what's for dinner. The water got too hot to touch. And soon, we saw dead animals in the river. This snake died because it fell in the river. Insane. Because the river can get as hot as 100 degrees Celsius. The boiling river is hot enough to cook an egg, hot enough to make a cup of tea, and yes, hot enough to kill you. It was so hot over there that I almost fainted. I started seeing black. Wow, this is hot. Yeah, is it that hot? I kid you not, this is degree burns. I don't know, one, two, three, five degree burns. A boiling river. Now that's interesting. 
And then there was the Amazon in Peru. It covers 60% of the country. It has the rarest nature in the world. And so many people in Peru are working to save the nature, like this guy. Hi, Nas Daily. I'm Topher White, and I, along with my team around the world, give Rainforest a chance to call for help. See, there is a big problem with people cutting down trees in the Amazon. The police cannot stop it because they never know it's happening until it's too late. There's birds, monkeys, insects. They're all really loud, so you can't really hear anything else. That's why this guy decided to put phones in trees across the Amazon rainforest so that when someone tries to cut down a tree, the cell phone calls the police automatically and someone immediately comes to stop the crime. This way, more than 400,000 hectares of forests are protected. This is an incredible project in 35 countries, including Peru. Phones in trees? also interesting. And he's not the only one saving nature. I met another guy that cleaned an entire lake in Peru. Hi, my name is Marino. Marino was really worried about the pollution in this lake. So he used crazy organic biology to turn this dirty lake into this clean lake. He is just one of many people I met that are saving nature in Peru every day. I even met a couple that is turning poop into green energy. Yes, now we're talking about poop. They figured out a way to turn this guinea pig poop into energy. Then they use it to turn on the lights and power their farm. Now that is an interesting farm. We make this product from the guinea pig poop. When people think of Peru, they think of Machu Picchu. But Peru is so much more. It is a country unlike any I've ever seen, with fruits as a language, 4,000 types of potatoes, rivers that boil, people that put cell phones in trees, others that clean lakes, and others that turn poop into energy. Peru really is the most interesting country in Latin America.